அனைவருக்கும் வணக்கம் தமிழ் தாயின் பாதங்களை வழங்கி இந்த இனிய நிகழ்வினை தொடங்கி வைப்பதில் மகிழ்ச்சி அடைகின்றேன் திருக்குறள் ஃபவுண்டேஷன் we could combine our collective efforts towards taking tirukkural to unesco as a universal literature international tirukkural foundation mauritius and the tamil valarchi mandram initiated and conducted successful international tirukkural conferences in many parts of the world with variety of themes after 2019 sydney conference being a successful one highlighting the underpinning theme tirukkural and peace and harmony followed by an online conference in 2020 tirukkural and multiculturalism these conferences have increased the confidence of dr armugam parasraman and his team to host monthly events to further strengthen the evidences to take tirukkural to unesco as a universal literature the focus of the team dr armugam parasraman has initiated the first online tirukkural and unesco series on tiruvalluvar day in 2021 inviting honorable mr justice r mahadevan high court of madras as a guest speaker since then we have been doing so many conferences with the purpose to identify the role and value of tirukkural in promoting universality understand the importance of tirukkural as universal literature creation of action plan to encourage learning tirukkural among the next generations to celebrate and promote tirukkural and tiruvalluvar to take tirukkural as a universal literature to the unesco is our current aim focus and all our efforts are going towards that today is another milestone we have the learned professors dr shanmugadas and his wife uh, mrs manonmani shanmugadas i now invite dr parasraman to formally introduce them to the audience thank you thank you very much dr chandika i um, it's my honor and privilege to <clears throat> welcome our distinguished professor aruna salam sanmugadas and mrs manonmani who uh, for this uh, very important conference that we are going to have today and on the theme why tirukkural has to be is to be presented to the world very interesting question which will certainly give us a lot of food for thought let me introduce dr sanmukhadas <clears throat> he was born in january 1940 in trincomalee uh, sri lanka he graduated from the university of ceylon in 1963 and obtained his doctorate in linguistics from the university of edinburgh scotland well supervised by professor ari asha asha in 1971 this is very unique and i'm very happy and pleased that you had the privilege of having professor asha as your supervisor uh had been teaching in sri lankan universities for more than 40 years and was the dean of the faculties of arts and graduate studies in university of jaffna he was also the he was also a visiting professor at gakul swen university in japan uh, university of ibadan in nigeria has published more than 40 books and we is mr vimal or uh, vimal saminaden and dr s manonmani he has translated Karunto K into Sinhala Sinhala language. He was awarded senior research fellowship by the Japan Foundation 1963. Government of Sri Lanka awarded him Saitya Ratna in 2008 for his services for literary studies. He attended and presented papers at the World Tamil Teachers Conference held in Singapore, Malaysia, Madras, Mauritius and South Africa. for advising and organizing the great festival of tirukkural in 2019 he was um, presented with the president's award by his excellency maitri pala senana senana ike the president of the democratic socialist republic of sri lanka the world tamil sangam madurai awarded him its prize for tamil grammar in the year 2020 so we could see how 
We have such an eminent and erudite speaker today with us. We feel very honored. And I am confident that this is our 12th international conference. As, as those of you have been following it very uh, actively with us, you would know that to date we have done 12 international conferences. And for the year 2021, we have still three more. So we'll end up with 15 international conferences by the end of this year. So I would like to thank our participants who are very loyal to the conference. Many of them are, are, are present regularly. And uh, so therefore, with these few words, I think we're all impatiently waiting to listen to Dr. Sanmugadas. I have the pleasure now to invite you to address the conference. Thank you, Dr. Sanmugadas. Thank you very much. <laughs> I am very much pleased to have this opportunity to deliver this speech at this international conference on Terracoral and UNESCO for World Peace. I must thank uh, Dr. Chandrika Subramanian, who requested me to deliver a talk on Terracoral. But I never thought that I am going to deliver this talk at an international conference on Terracoral and UNESCO for world peace, and that too under the chairmanship of Professor Dr. Parasuraman, who is striving hard to lift our Mudusong up above the world so high. Last time I met him in Nagar Koil in 2017, May 17th, where the International Conference on Tirkural held to urge the UNESCO to declare the Everlasting masterpiece, Tirukkural, authored by Tamil sage Tiruvalluvar about 2000 year ago, years ago, as the book of the world. Mr. Kumar Punidavel, who is here, he was also there at uh, Nagarkoil at the conference. I thank uh, Dr. Parasuraman on behalf of the proud people who own this great uh, text of this planet. My present greetings to all my friends, scholars, and my students who are present here this evening. I must, my special thanks uh, to Professor Parasuraman for his uh, uh, words about me. I thank you. The question that is posed to us today is why Terukural to be presented to the world? We have already been told by Mahakavi Subramanya Bharati that Balluvan Tannai Ivulahinikke Tandu Van Puhal Konda Tamil Nadu. Tamil Nadu had given Valluvar unto the world and had thereby won great renown. This is the translation of that poetic and prophetic line. According to poet Bharati, Valluva's text, the Tirukkural, has already been given to the world. Without diverting your mind or deviating from the point, I like to present a quotation from William Norman Guthrie's book, The Poet as Prophet. <clears throat> a poet could be a prophet but he abstains from conscious prophecy. A message that he keeps to himself ensures a certain passionate earnestness, a virility of tone, manner, a preternatural preter, preter, preter courage. For the true prophecies are in every case the unconscious and inevitable prophecy delivered not out of desire to teach and improve us, but from mad love of the doctrine. We understand from this short passage that, like any other poet prophet, Mahagavi Subramanya Bharati too has delivered a prophecy, not out of desire to instruct us to present Tirukkural unto the world, but from mad love of the doctrine.
poet Bharati had a mad love for doctrine called Tirukkural. In his inner vision, he had seen that it has been lifted to the world. He has seen several such things in his inner vision. One of them is this. It is our duty to make it true. What has been foreseen by Bharati has to be made true. Having this in our mind, let us answer the question why Tirukkural has to be presented to the world. Tirukkural is a universal scripture because there is no specific reference to any particular race, or religion, country, or rule. It looks like a simple statement uh, saying that Tirukkural is a universal scripture because there is no specific reference to any particular race, religion, religion, country, or rule. It looks like a simple statement, but it is not so. I hope no one will dispute that Tirukkural is rendered in Tamil language. The world has acknowledged that there is a race called Tamils who speak a language called Tamil. We are aware that this race has a country and also has people following various religions. In spite of it, the author of this literary text, Tirukkural, has nothing to say anything about the Tamil race, Tamil religion, Tamil country, and even Tamil language in which he has rendered the text. Why? I leave this question to you. At the end of my talk, if anyone could give plausible answer to it, we'll be thankful to him or her. The Tamils are proud of that they are ancestors. They are proud of, proud that they have been given this finest composition, embodying the spiritual vision, the ethical wisdom, and the ideals of kinship and polity of India. It does not deal with or develop any specific system of thought or philosophy as such, but contains the best of all. There is a bro broad unity and cohesion pervading his thought, which embraces almost the totality of human life and experience. The undying fame of this immortal work has secured translation of it in, a, in several languages of the world. The author of this treatise speaks of a God who is common to all. He says specifically in his opening chapter that God has to be praised and worshiped because this will lead to happiness, freedom from mental chaos and salvation at the end. Confucius declared that he who offends uh, against heaven has none to whom he can pray. Thiruvalluvar confirms this by several couplets, but here I give a few. Malarmisai erginan, manadi sendar, nilamisai nuduvalvar. Those who surrender themselves at the glorious feet of the one who resides in the flower-like hearts of all will live long in this earth. Tanakuvamai illadan thal sendar kallal manakavalai matral adidu. Except for those who surrender at the feet of the one who is incomparable, it is tough to cure, cure the mental views. Puravi perangadal ninduvar nindar revanadi seradar. Those who surrender at the feet of the God will cross the great ocean of life. Others won't. Only in the introductory chapters, that is one to three, does Thiruvalluvar sound religious. Even here, he maintains a tone that could be acceptable to people of all faiths. The very first verse of Tirukkural says, 
as a letter A is the first of all, first of all letters. So the eternal God is first in the world. The universal nature of this great text begins with the very first verse itself. This couplet could be written at the entrance of any religious place in the world. What else you can say to express the global view of the ancient Tamils? Valuver climbed many steps further to render many teachings to the world. The great man of India, Mr. APJ Abdul Kalam, the former president of India, he says, Tirukural is considered to provide the code of conduct for the humanity of the planet Earth for all time, which makes the past meet the present and creates the future. So we are satisfied that we have a scripture that is useful to the whole universe. Why should we be selfish? We are proud that we own it. Let us share it with the whole world. I remember Michael Jack Jackson when he was a boy, a small boy, when I was studying in Edinburgh. I was able to listen to his uh, songs. He was a small boy and he, a famous song, I liked it. He sang, I like to teach the world to sing in perfect harmony. And I would like to hold it in my arm and keep it company. I like to teach the world to sing in perfect harmony. And I like to keep it, I like to hold it in my arm and keep it company. Let us hold the world and share Tirukural with it and rejoice. It was reported that a citizen of Tamil Nadu filed a case before the Madras High Court to ask for appropriate action from the court to prevent rising criminality and immor immorality and the lack of moral lessons in these schools. Having studied the case, the judge, his name has been mentioned here, the famous judge, he ordered the Tamil Nadu government to make the study of Tirukural compulsory in all schools. And further, he said that students, teachers, and the population as a whole are bound to become responsible citizens if they, by learning and teachings of Tirukural and apply them in their daily life. We all know that learning and teaching will definitely produce responsible citizens. As the Honorable Judge said in his judgment, Tirukural must be taught and learned because it is designed for it. It is designed for the whole world. Let me share with you what Dr. Kamil Zuelabil, a great Tamil scholar from Czechoslovakia, says about the subject of Tirukural. Dr. Zuelabil is a great Tamil scholar. He has translated Tolkapiam into English and he has written many papers and, uh, and he was uh, in Madras when the second international Tamil conference held and he was one of the general secretaries. And uh, because of uh, his uh, services uh, to Tamil, uh, they used to call him not Tamil Zuelabil, Tamil Zuelabil. He says, that man in the totality of his relationship is the subject of Quran. After a cosmic introduction which praises God, rain, superman, and virtue, the author of the book turns towards man. After describing all these rain and all, and uh, general uh, nature and other things, he turns towards man whose personality is gradually unfolded in ever-expanding concentric uh, cycles within the family, with his wife and children, 
within the community, with his friends, and within his country, in his relationship towards the ruler and the state, man is shown not in a static state, but in the development. And the force that is behind this dynamism is sympathy, even love, manifesting itself through kind thoughts, sweet words, and right actions. Tirukural is designed such a way that it should be taught and learned. Here again, why should we be selfish? Let us share it with the world. Tirukural, an ancient Indian treatise on the ethics and morality of human beings, is one of the most widely translated non-religious works in the world. It has been translated into about 42 languages. Since uh, this great work has been translated into the greatest number of languages, it is called as Ulaha Podumare, meaning the common knowledge for the world. How did Thiruvalluvar who has written this more than 2,000 years ago, was able to gauge the mentality of the people through the decades. People all over the world are same with their needs and thoughts. So this is why Tirukural is translated in many languages. The needs and thoughts have to be fulfilled. Many more translations have to be offered to the world. Dr. Gio Pope was the first scholar to translate into English in full. I enjoyed the translation of a Kural. Let me share it with you. The Kural is Patraha Patatan Patinai. A Patrai Patraha Patubudak. The word Patri is used uh, in this uh, Kural. One, two, three, four, five, six, six times it has been used. And his uh, translation, uh, it is metrical translation. Uh, at the Nagar Koyil uh, uh, International Conference, uh, Thirukural Conference, uh, Dr. Pope's translation was uh, reproduced, reprinted by Professor Parasuraman and, uh, and Dr. John Samuel. And it was given to their delegates. Uh, we were lucky to have uh, one of those copy. And in that, uh, Professor Parasuraman and Dr. John Samuel say that G.U. Pope's work is a metrical translation where he tries to reproduce even a rhyme in many cases, though he confesses to his inability to retain the inimitable grace, condensation, and other stylistic aspects of the original. So regarding this Tirukural uh, Patraha, Pope's translation, in, in that translation, in his metrical translation, he uses the word cling for the word Tamil word Patra. Cling thou to that which he to whom not clings have bit the cling cling to that bond to get thee free from every clinging thing patriha patratan patrinai patriha cling thou to that which he patriha patratan he to whom not clings. Nothing clings to him. He is free, entirely free. So it's easy to cling him. Had with the cling, cling to that bond. A patrai patriha patchubadak to get thee from every clinging thing, to get free from the uh, bond, you have to cling to him who 
whom not clings, nothing clings on. So in their in 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 this uh, uh, translation, what I find is that Dr. Pope uh, wanted to uh, translate it exactly. You know, that's a metrical translation. Is, metrical translation is very difficult to translate, but if it is translated, it's it's easy to understand uh, because uh, uh, Dr. Manonmani, when she translated Manyoshu, uh, she translated. It was a metrical translation because. Uh, uh, the the myth, the meter used by Japanese uh, uh, scholar Japanese poets in uh, Manyoshu is also uh, found in our Tamil literature exactly the same uh, meter. So we have common metrical form and common culture and common other things. So it was easy to translate. Here, Doctor Pope uh, he tried uh, his best to uh, resort to. Uh, metrical translation of Tirukural. In a paper on G.U. Pope's metrical translation of uh, Tirukural, an evaluation of the translation of a classic, uh, the uh, IUP journal English studies, uh, Priscilla R. Margaret Joy and Daniel James, uh, they have uh, uh, written this paper, that is G.U. Pope's metrical translation of the Tirukural an evaluation of the translation of a classic. Here they show that uh, G.U. Pope resorted to metrical translation in keeping with the Victorian trend of adopting the, the style of the poetry of the previous age to suggest the greatness of high Tamil poetry. Many more translations of this classical work will benefit the humanity. In order to encourage such translations, Tirukural has to be presented to the world. Mahagavi Subramanya Bharati has appropriately called, declared that Valluvan Dannai Ki Vulahinakke Tandu Vanpugal Konda Tamil Nadu. But however, what is that gift? How great it is. Great people of this planet have already told us how great it is. Let me list uh, some of them. Charles E. Gower, an English uh, folklorist, he says, the choral sentences are be binding as the Ten Commandments on the Jews. Choral is as important and influential on the Tamil mind as Dante's uh, great work on the language and thought of Italy. George L. Hart, American Indologist, he says, everyone knows the Tirukural, one of the world's greatest works on ethics, but this is merely one of a myriad of major, extremely varied works that comprise the Tamil classical tradition. There is not a facet of human existence that is not explored and illuminated by this great literature. Madras High Court order, I repeat again, Judge Mahalavan, um, his uh, judgment, the future of every country lies at the hands of younger generation. It is a duty of the state to show them the rightful path and there is no other better philosophy than what is preached in Tirukkural. Honorable Narendra Modi, the Indian Prime Minister said, I bow to the great Tiruvalluvar, simple and vast in scope. His thoughts and writings have been a strong influence on humanity for centuries. Tirukkural does not refer to nation, leader, society, language, religion, or cast in the entire book, which is why it has been called the Universal Veda. Reverend Peter Percival, Christian missionary and the reviser of Tamil version of uh, the Bible, Terukural will be read with pleasure as affording proof of the existence of the loftiest sentiments. 
the purest moral rules and equal power of conception and expression. Nothing certainly in the whole compass of human language can equal the force and terseness of the sentious, sententious dishes in which the author conveys the lessons of wisdom he utters. Jiyu Pope says he was undoubtedly one of the great geniuses of the world. Complete in itself, the sole work of its author has come down the stream of ages, absolutely uninjured. Hardly a single various readings of any importance being found. In value, it outweighs the whole of the remaining Tamil literature and is one of the selected numbers of great, work, great works which have entered into the every soul of a whole people and which can never die. Sane Guruji, Marathi, Marathi author, teacher and nationalist, he says, great thinkers belongs to the world. Tiruvalluvar belongs not only to Tamil Nadu, but also the whole of India, to the whole of world. He wrote for the benefit of the whole mankind. After reading Kural, we will realize that Indian culture all over the country is one. The art of this great country is full of same blood. Rabindranath Tagore, he says, the ideas of great Saint Val Tiruvalluvar will apply not only to India, but the whole world. Reverend Emmons E. White, Tirukural is a synthesis of the best moral teachings of the world. The Taiwanese poet and translator Yu Hisi says, Tirukural, he translated Tirukural in Mandarin. Whenever I read a couple couplet from Tirukural here and there, as I do daily, I am surprised at most every reading at its freshness and relevance to the problems of our times. For such, its universality and humanism. The gift has been well decorated. The worthiness of the gift has been well said by different types of people. It is now being presented to the world by Tamils. It's the Tamils gift to the world. Let me conclude my talk with a few words in Tamil about law and law. Chicago will not be there. Pangabatia, Nanamanumani, Mother de Pangabati Rundo, and the Tamlarachi Manat Le Pangabatia, Miha Aria Pata, Tamilnati, Edea Satrashi Nipuner, Munal Tamilnada, Arasin Amateur, Amarer Perasir, and Balahana, our Red Merhana, Doctor White Sokalingam, our Red, or Karatina and Gepuvi than there, Ada Ingenan, Sola Birambo and Renenda than the Katura Kalala Minam Pruntle Varavile, and a Kurta Padiala de Ungaludan Pahindu Kalavanam and Ravale, Ade Kurukun. Pandakala Til, Manakal Archisai the Bodu, Nidi Avar Valanga Padabandam and Ru, Valdever Kuri, a Valimurakal, Gundre, Nidi Mandrakalakum, Mulumayaha, Purunduvanabaham in Gutan. Saman Chaid, Sirukum Kolpol. Amaind Urupal Kodami Sandro Kuani Mune Tan Samanaga Nundri Tav the Tarase Tukinal Mune al Samanaga Nitkan Radu Pin Tanadate Vita Parate Urupakatale on Ravita Manda and the Parate Varear Kum Tula Kol Pol Amaind Pahaiver Sutatever Nanber Andru Urupal Saya Maye Sandor Ku Alaka Sandro Renberi Indreya Nidimandrangale Kuripadaka Adepol 
நீதி தேவதையின் கைகளில் ஒரு துலாக்கோல் தரப்பட்டிருக்கிறது என்பதை பார்க்கும் போது முதன் முதலில் நீதி வழங்கும் முறைக்கு துலாக்கோலை உலகுக்கு காட்டியது வள்ளுவதான் என்று எண்ணக்கூடியதாய் உள்ளது ஓர்ந்து கண்ணோடாது இறை புரிந்து யார் மாட்டும் தேர்ந்து செய்வாகுதே முறை இன்னொரு குரல் ஐநூற்றி நாற்பத்தி ஓராவது குரல் சமன் செய்து செய்தூக்கும் அந்த கோல் போல் அந்த குரலை போன்று இன்னொரு குரல் ஓர்ந்து கண்ணோடாது இறை புரிந்து யார் மாட்டும் தேர்ந்து செய்வது அகுதே முறை என்னும் குரலும் சட்டமும் திருக்குறளும் என்மை என்னும் பொருண்மை தொடர்பாக கூர்ந்து நோக்கப்பட வேண்டியது ஒன்றாக உள்ளது கண்ணோட்டம் என்பது தன்னோடு பழகியவரை கண்டால் அவர் கூறிய என மறுக்க மாட்டார் கண்ணோட்டம் அதுதான் எங்களுடைய கண் கண்ணோட்டம் என்றதுதான் கண் ஓடிக்கொண்டிருக்கும் எல்லாவற்றையும் கவனித்துக் கொண்டிருக்கும் யார் எப்படி இருக்கின்றார்கள் எப்படி நடக்கின்றார்கள் என்ன மாதிரி இருக்கின்றார்களா இந்த வேளையிலே கண் சென்ற வழி நிகழ்வது ஆகலின் கண்ணோட்டம் என்று அதுக்கு பெயர் பெற்றது என்னக்கு எனக்கு தெரிந்தவர் ஒருவர் எனக்கு நேரே வந்து சொல்லுகின்றார் இதை நீங்கள் ஒரு க செய்ய வேண்டும் என்று சொன்னால் அவர் தெரிந்தவர் என்றபடியால் அவரை பழகியவரை என்னோடு பழகியவரை கண்ட உடனே அவர் கூறியனவற்றை மறுக்க மாட்டாமை உடையதாக இருக்கின்ற நிலை என்ற கண்ணோட்டம் கண் சென்ற வழி நிகழ்வது ஆதலில் கண்ணோட்டம் என்றும் பெயர் பெற்றது கண்ணோட்டம் என்பது நாகரிகம் என்று பரிமேலழகர் சொல்லுவர் திருக்குறளுக்கு உரிய எழுதிய பரிமேலழகர் பெயக்கண்டும் நஞ்சுண்டமைவர் நயத்தக்க நாகரிகம் வேண்டுபவர் என்னும் குரல் உரையிலேயே இவ்வாறு கூறுகிறார் முந்தை இருந்து நட்டோர் கொடுப்பின் அதாவது முன்னுக்கு இருந்து கொண்டு எங்கள் எங்களோடு நட்பு பூண்ட ஒருவர் கொடுப்பின் நஞ்சும் முன்பர் நனி நாகரிகர் என்று சொல்லி சங்க இலக்கியம் ஆகிய நற்றுணையில கூறப்படுகிறது அது முன்னரே கூறப்பட்டுள்ளது கண்ணோட்டம் நட்பினை பேண வழி வழிபவிப்பதை காட்டுகிறேன் கண்ணுக்கு அழகு கண்ணோட்டமே என்று வள்ளுவர் கூறுகிறேன் இவ்வாறு ஒரு அதிகாரத்தைய வகுத்து கண்ணோட வேண்டும் என்று கூறும் வள்ளுவர் நீதி வழங்கும் போது கண்ணோடாது என்று கூறுகிறேன் அந்த முதல் குரல்லே கண்ணோடாது என்று சொல்றேன் ஓர்ந்து கண்ணோடாது கண்ணுக்கு அழகு கண்ணோட்டமே என்று வண்டுமே சொல்லுகிறார் இவ்வாறு ஒரு அதிகாரம் வகுத்து கண்ணோட்டம் பற்றி சொல்லுகின்றார் ஆனால் நீதி வழங்கும் போது கண்ணோடாது என்று சொல்லுகின்றார் நீதி தேவதையின் கண்கள் கட்டி இருப்பது வள்ளுவர் கண்ணோடாது என்று சொன்னதாலே தான் ஏற்பட்டதோ என்று என்ன தோன்றுகின்றார் இது இந்த கருத்து கேட்டபொழுது எனக்கு மிக விருப்பமாக இருந்தது அதனாலே உங்களுடன் இதை பகிர்ந்து கொள்ளுகின்றேன் அதாவது நீதி தேவையின் கண்கள் கட்டி இருப்பதை நாங்கள் காணுகின்றோம் அவ்வாறு கட்டுவதற்கு காரணம் கண் ஓடுவது எங்களுடைய இயல் கண்ணோட்டம் கண் ஓடாமல் இருப்பதற்காக நீதி தேவதையின் கண்கள் கட்டப்பட்டுள்ளது என்று இது உலக நீதிக்கு வள்ளுவனின் திருக்குறள் வழங்கிய வழி அந்த உலகுக்கே இதனை வழங்குவது உடாக உலகம் மேலும் பல நன்மைகளை பெறும் என்பதில் என்பதில் ஐயம் இல்லை முன்னர் குறிப்பிட்ட ஓர்ந்து கண்ணோடாது இறை புரிந்து யார் மட்டும் தேர்ந்து செய்வதே முறை என்ற அந்த குரலிலே இன்னொரு நுட்பமான பொறுமையினை வள்ளுவர் கூறியுள்ளதை திரு சொக்கலிங்கம் அவர்கள் குறிப்பிட்டதை அந்த மாநாட்டிலே கேட்டு நான் மிகவும் அதனை ரசித்தேன் அவர் கூறியதை அப்படியே இங்கு தருகிறேன் மேலே கண்டுள்ள குரட்பாவில் ஓர்ந்து கண்ணோடாது இறை புரிந்து என்பதற்கு இறை வேண்டி அல்லது இறை தொழுது இறை புரிந்து என்பதற்கு பதிலாக இறைவனை வேண்டி அல்லது இறைவனை தொழுது என்ற சொற்களை பயன்படுத்தி இருக்கலாம் இறைவனை தொழுது நீதி தீர்த்த அது பயன் அது அப்படி பயன்படுத்தி இருந்தால் குறட்பா சரியாக இருந்திருக்கு ஆனால் அச்சொற்களை பய பயன்படுத்த வள்ளுவர் தயாரில்லை ஏனென்றால் உரைப்பட உடைக்கப்படுகின்ற நீதி தெய்வமே உரைத்ததாக இருக்க வேண்டும் அதனால்தான் இறை புரிந்து என்று வலியுறுத்தி இறைவனை தொழுது இந்த ஜட்ஜ் இந்த நீதிபதி கூறுகின்றதாக அல்ல இறைவனே அங்கு நீதி தீர்க்கின்றான் ஆஹ் நீதி தேவதையே இந்த நீதியினை வழங்குகின்றது என்று நீதி தேவதை வழங்கும் தீர்ப்பு இறைவன் வழங்கும் தீர்ப்பு என்பதை வலியுறுத்தும் 
ஒரு நூல் கட்டாயமாக உலகத்தின் நூலாக இருக்க வேண்டும் என்பதை எண்ணியே திருக்குறளை உலகுக்கு வழங்க வேண்டும் என்பதை அறம்போற்றும் அறிஞர்களும் மரம்போற்றும் வீரர்களும் மனிதனேயும் மிக்காரும் சிந்தனையாளர்களும் பேராசிரியர் பெர பரசுராமனும் முனைவர் சந்திரிகாவும் வேண்டுகின்றனர் என்று கூறி என்னுடைய இந்த உரையை நிறைவு செய்கின்றேன் Let me thank you all for listening to me. Once again, I thank Dr. Chandrika for giving me this wonderful opportunity to ad address you all. I am very grateful to Prof. Dr. Parasuraman for his untiring efforts taken to raise our great treaties to the hands of the world. Thank you very much. Thank you, Dr. Sanmugadas. A very enlightening and enriching speech you've given, which adds to all the advocacy we've been making to take Tirukural to the world. But as you rightly said, Tirukural is already with the world, but our initiative is to take it through the institution, that is through UNESCO, because once you go, go through that U, uh, UN agency, then it has still wider recognition and impact. So uh, let me, uh, I'm sure we'll have a few questions from the audience, but uh, let me, uh, well, I'll, I'll invite the members of the audience, if you have any question to ask Dr. Sanmugadas. And before that, probably Dr. Sanmugadas, I don't know, uh, we'll be very uh, graced uh, by if uh, Dr. Manon Mani would like to say a few words. Hello. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> very much, since you are with us, we're very honored and happy to have your even short message. Okay, thank you. Anyway, I'll speak in Tamil. Yes. திருக்குறளை உலகிற்கு வழங்குகின்ற ஒரு பொறுப்பு உணர்வோடு அனைவரும் ஒன்றாக கூடியிருக்கின்றோம் அந்த வகையில் இந்த இணையவழி மூலமாக சில கருத்துக்களை பகிர்ந்து கொள்வது இன்றைய காலகட்டத்திற்கு மிகவும் பொருத்தமாக இருக்கின்றது திருக்குறளுக்கு என்னை பொறுத்த வரையில் நிறைய உரைகள் எழுதப்பட்டு விட்டன இருந்தாலும் அடுத்த தலைமுறையினருக்கு பிற மொழியாளர்களுக்கு கூட தமிழ் மொழியிலே திருக்குறளின் உரையை கேட்பதற்கு ஒரு புதிய உரை நூல் இன்றியமையதாக இருக்கின்றது அந்த வகையில் கடந்த இந்த கொரோனா தொற்று காலத்தை பயன்படுத்தி நான் ஒரு எளிமையான உரையை ஆக்கி இருக்கின்றேன் அந்த உரை நான் ஆக்குவதற்கு காரணம் இத்தகைய கருத்தரங்குகளிலே பங்கு கொள்ளுகின்ற போது அடுத்த தலைமுறையினர்கள் வேறு வேறு மொழியை பேசுகின்றவர்கள் கூட எங்கள் மொழியை கேட்க வேண்டும் திருக்குறளை தமிழிலே படிக்க வேண்டும் காந்தி ஒரு முறை சொல்லி இருக்கிறார் அதாவது இந்த திருக்குறளை எனக்கு மூல மொழியிலே படிக்க முடியாதது மிகவும் கவலையாக இருக்கிறதுன்னு சொல்லி அந்த மாதிரி இந்த அடுத்த தலைமுறையினர்கள் இந்த மொழியை கேட்பதற்கு ஒரு எளிமையான உரை தேவை அந்த உரையாக்கத்தை நான் சேர்க்கிறேன் என்ற குறிப்பை மட்டும் கூறி இத்தகைய கருத்தரங்களே என்னையும் சில வார்த்தைகளை பேசுவதற்கு ஒப்புதல் தந்தமைக்கு நன்றி கூறி உடைபடுத்தேன் நன்றி மிக்க நன்றி ஐ வில் நவ் இன்வைட் தி மெம்பர்ஸ் தி பார்ட்டிசிபன்ஸ் டு ஆஸ்க் क्वेश्चंस ஆர் மேக் காமெண்ட்ஸ் as they wish any observation any comments those who want to speak please unmute and they can speak yeah 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 i have unmuted my name is ashraf i live in delhi mm -hmm. i work for the wildlife trust of india i am the vice president of the organization and i have uh, given a, a talk on this international cultural foundation conference a couple of months back and uh, i you had actually asked mr chanmudas actually asked a question in the beginning uh, 
is there any other work why kural does not mention anything about tamil and i have the answer the answer is trikural is not the only work in tamil that does not talk about tamil or tamil language out of the 18 minor works only in two works karnaarpudu and tinaimoli tinaimale mutaimbudu you will find tamil mentioned once the problem is many of us forget that we have other ethical literatures also in tamil and uh, the the size of the work may be small but in no way uh, inferior to trikural the inferiority comes only because of the coverage area is less Yes. and they're good enough they are also completely uh, uh, n- not even though the authors belong to different religious sects the texts are completely uh, not aligned to any particular thing so it is not only trikural many literature is also there and uh, that is one point i would like to tell you two more things you mentioned about this beautiful couplet patriga patratan patinai apatrai patriga patrudarke and i didn't know that pope has uh, also tried to render it uh, in uh, with a similar rhyming but the best effort and uh, most successfully is done by p s sundaram sundaram yes uh, yeah clings cling to the one who clings to nothing and so clinging cease to cling i mean I, i would say i don't think anyone even though the word clinging is not the apt word but still he is the one who has uh, done it for many couplets not only this in trikur I mean, his translation i would say is, is perhaps the best of all and do uh, you mentioned about a very important thing the last one kannoda ad irai puridal i have um, it's a good point <laughs> of course i don't we do not know whether valluvar meant actually the neeri devadai but it is a very good point konna kannoda ad irai puridal Uh, in kalitoga you have this verse kanno kannodad uh uir velaval that is his uh, the king should give a punishment or uh, execute a person without showing compassion i have uh, while drawing illustrations for all the 1330 couplets i had used not only the sorens illustrate depiction of him punishing the son as the uh, illustration to for the quiz now this is a, you have given me a good idea i will have an alternate version of a nidhi devadai with uh, a justice being there and so that people can identify kannodad veerwalavar and the kannodad irai puri thank you so much for uh, your wonderful presentation yeah, thank you it was yeah uh, to thank uh, mr sokalingam for this uh, <laughs> I mean, I enjoyed uh, that when so, I was so telling that, the credit uh, goes to Sukhalinga. Uh, okay. Yeah, mm-hmm. cardiac uh, surgeon, you know, famous uh, surgeon in South India. In South India. The wise Sukhalinga. I hope he uh, he did he go to uh, Singapore for any conference. I, I think he 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 should have gone. <laughs> he has come to Sri Lanka. Uh, because about uh, five years back. i got a surprising uh, mail from a person who attended a conference is a cardiac surgeon in yeah, uh, singapore surgeon, yes. uh, and he said your trikural translations i have put trikural translations in many languages and a lot of articles he said was very useful for my international cardiology conference i said hey, i was wondering how can trikural be useful cardiology i didn't know maybe, maybe it's the same person i don't know. yes i think it's, it's the same person i have listened to him he came to sri lanka gave a few speeches first time i met in madras of course uh, and uh, he has some because uh, the uh, different discipline uh, mm. when two uh, you know uh, fusion takes place and that's a new there's new thinking there okay so, thank you thank you thank you so much about uh, the use of word uh, tamil uh, the absence of that word in uh, uh, in the literature of course we have uh, Sorry, in in, 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 <laughs> in sangam works uh, we have this word tamil tamil nadu but in tirukkural he has not you and later also you have mentioned that one or two places the word comes we have a problem in in tolhapiyam uh, the he says tolhapi says that uh, tamil uh, plus pillai 
will uh, you know uh, uh, Sunday the Sunday takes place and it will be uh, joined as Tamilapillai not Tamil Pillai, Tamil Pillai. Okay. and uh, we know that in Dhammapada um, and uh, Pagada uh, in, um, works in Pagada Prakrit language Pali works uh, they use the word Tamil Tamil, Tamil, ah, Tamil. Tamil. Yeah. instead of Tamil 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 Mahavamsa Tamil 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 Damila. So uh, maybe there may be a problem in using uh, the word Tamil itself because Tolhapir in Uriyan he says Tamil, Tamil in Kulavi, Taniya Tamil and Ramoli Matra Malla. It also denotes uh, love, uh, Kadal, Tamil Kadal, Tamil Kadal. So that's how I think, but. I have a feeling that uh, Thiruvalluvar must have been a very proud man. You know? uh, otherwise, he wouldn't have uh, produced this kind of treatise. So, he didn't want to advertise him. It's uh, like he, him huh? he didn't want to say that I am a Tamil, I am a, I am belong to this religion. And he knows that it's uh, his work uh, will, uh, will be sold uh, like a hot capes. <laughs> So he knows that he was proud of it. He didn't want an advertisement. So that's what I feel. I, I okay. know me. That man is writing it in Tamil. And he, is, he belongs to Tamil race, uh, Tamil uh, uh, Nadu. And I don't know about his religion, uh, that is uh, disputable. But anyway, I don't, I don't want to go into that. So that's how I feel. I have I have one more question. Since you live in Sri Lanka and yeah. you have translated Puruntagai into Sinhala language, I want to know. I mean, when I went to Sri Lanka, I've been there twice. I generally, whenever I go travel abroad, I try to get their uh, that particular nation's important ethical literature. So I asked the Sinhalese uh, if you have any ethical literature in Sinhala language. I nobody was able to give me an answer. I just would like to know whether they have any, even if it is a contemporary or medieval, if you know of any uh, text in Sinhala. Yeah, they are. Uh, Mahavamsa is... Uh, not is an a, ethical it's a, it's yeah. a historical it's not an ethical literature. Yeah. That's worth mentioning. Mm. Because they are... They are, they are that is in, that uh, in Pali. That is not in Sinhala. Yeah, that's in Pali. Pali. Yeah. Literary yes. uh, uh, history starts very late. Uh, but uh, they have translated Tirukural into Singhala. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I have put it on my Singhala, Yes, yeah. they have translated them into Singhala. Uh, but uh, they have not yet produced uh, a work like uh, Tirukural or <clears throat> ethical uh, literature. But um, number of uh, novels, uh, short stories and poems they have uh, produced uh, recently and uh, from... Uh, after uh, 14th or 15th century, uh, uh, they are developed, the literary development is very fast. And anyway, but, thanks uh, for so much. I just, a last comment before I would like to give others the opportunity to interact with you about this word for the elephant in Sinhala language. Uh, you know, Sinhala, Sinhala language did have an opportunity for it to mm. borrow from another Indo Aryan language, so a lot of borrowing some Tamil. They call the word, they say Aliyah, you might have yeah, yes. Aliyah. <clears throat> so Aliyah. Aliyah is because the, most of the elephants in uh, Sinhala, the, the, the males do not have tusks, they are all Mordegal or Makanas. Yeah. So uh, Aliyah is the word that is used and uh, Ali, you know Ali in Tamil means neither yeah. male nor female. So these elephants look yeah. like females but because they don't have tusks. So it is a clear uh, Tamil borrowing. Tamil yeah, there are a lot of uh, Tamil borrowings uh, in Singhala because a lot of uh, um, two or three Tamil uh, Singhala scholars have worked on it. The okay. first one, uh, Peter, Dr. Peter Silva, who went to, he had his PhD from Oxford, where he uh, compared uh, the borrowings uh, from Dravidian languages into Singhala. It was a very good uh, book. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Okay.
Thank you very much for this very interesting exchange between Dr. Asraf and Dr. Sanmugadas. Any other observation? Uh, uh, Don't have. Yes. I have a question for a sinna, Kerthena, Tamil Grande, or Muli, our Yellow Mode, our Tamil Muli, Tamil Purna Rai, Yagan Mukila, Palamuli, Pesakuni, Makal Yendir Kalan, Kerthila, or Martin Kerthila. A pretty good hour of Muli, our Tinji Puli, and the other. Other one that our day and the Muli, the region number two, is a fine for the Tuna of Nikila. That's the reason that he consciously avoided mentioning yeah, the word yeah, in my right. humble opinion. Mm -hmm. Similarly, for the religion, religion and the other religion, the Samadha Pandadana or Edad Mahana, he has made it uh, truly secular in his text as well as intention as well as the way he presented. Adhananda Mandi Ulaur Pudmariya Yurke. Another <laughs> Any other observation? Yeah, I, got a, I got a question, sir. Doctor, Mr. Rajendran? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, go ahead. Uh, Professor, um, as Ashraf was mentioning, um, uh, you know, that uh, you know, justice and war in the Kannoda, you know, Yad Martum. highlight My question is um, why, in spite of all the comprehensive nature of Tirukkural, why it has not reached the way Confucius teachings have uh, reached, Confucius sayings have reached. Uh, why uh, uh, even the kings in uh, India, uh, specifically in Tamil Nadu, have not adopted uh, Tirukkural as their guiding uh, principles? Locally, it has not been adopted. It's a fact. And now Tamils want the world need to adopt it. Why without adopting ourselves? Our kings have not adopted. Our, our ancestors have not adopted in public life. And only the individuals have adopted. Some religions have adopted. Now you say it transcends the religion. It uh, it goes. It should go outside the outside India. My point is why in the past we are not adopted, and why uh, what we need to do the world to adopt this. The, these are the two questions. Take your question. Uh, I'm uh, no, I think a wise of the family. People like uh, Ashraf has done a great work. 23 languages Ashraf has put it on his website, Kural translation. Individual work, it's a family work. He has put it in 23 languages, various languages of India and world. So, so these are my two questions, please. Uh, it's very unfortunate that uh, we didn't have uh, people like uh, Max Muller, Keith Winternitz, some those scholars who knew about Tamil. They were all interested in Sanskrit only. And uh, they took all the main works in Sanskrit to Germany and to all over Europe and other countries. And we didn't have that uh, opportunity. If, I think if uh, Dr. Colwell or Virama Maneuver would have come earlier. And if even, even they were not aware of uh, Sangam literature for a long time, Colwell didn't know Sangha. There was a, uh, a collection of uh, ancient Tamil poems uh, composed uh, uh, before Christ. And he, in his book, has mentioned that uh, Tamil literature. The history starts from uh, 600 AD. That's because the, he was not aware of it. And they didn't have that opportunity. If we had such people and the opportunity, then Tirukural would have, been, would have gone out 
and it would have been, uh, you know, before Albert Schweitzer or other people, uh, Tirukkural would have reached the uh, uh, Western world. And that's, that's, that's the answer I could give for that. We didn't have that, we are unfortunate. Um, thank you, thank you, I bro. think uh, if we have uh, Dr. I think Mr. Nyana Segaran, you raise yeah. your hand, please. Uh, what a come, good evening. Uh, <laughs> nice seeing you all. I'm Nyana Segaran. I also belong to Voice of Alluva family, created by our friend Mr. Rajendran and uh, participated by Mr. Dr. Ashraf also from the same, same clan. Uh, thank you and uh, thanks for giving an opportunity to raise my point. I have two things. One is my observation, another is a question. My observation, like uh, why Thirulvar has not used Tamil in, the, in his uh, work? Very simple. Now we are talking in a forum where we want to take it to the international forum. That's why we are talking Tamil in English, right? Referring Tamil in English. So there's a need for us to speak to speak in English to talk about Tamil. But whereas in our uh, world over days, probably it's a Tamil community because the distance was they have not traveled much because they are in our in our land only Tamil land only. There is not much of a you know, interference of other languages those days probably when world over was living. So there's no need for him to you know to to make his work for him to other language people should know. That was not his intention because his world was the Tamil world, wherever the, 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 the land which we, we were living in that time. That's why probably he has not touched the word in Tamil because why uh, we should talk. See, now I, I want to introduce my name. I say I'm Jana Shekhar and I'm so and so, so and so, so and so. But while we were lived in this, our land, this is meant for our people at those times. So, not, no need to introduce. Uh, the language and other things, probably that could be the reason because the Tamil, Tamil was in such a high position at that time. Yeah. Yeah. No need to talk about Tamil in this. No need. Yeah. 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 the reason which I am mm. thinking. Probably, I don't know. Uh, like a yeah. I accept that. That is, uh, it might have been uh, because we are unable to. They lived uh, 2000 years ago. Oh. Right. <laughs> yeah, now. Uh, Absolutely. Unless Absolutely. we get uh, solid, uh, you know, yeah. evidence uh, from Kuladi or... Uh, yeah. <laughs> for for, 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 for get... example, I've been talking in other forums in Tamil. This is the first time I'm talking in English to talk about Tamil, you know. This is a situation where the forum calls for. Maybe that kind of a forum was not there for him to demand him to, you know, to project it to other language people. That could be the reason. And number two, uh, is a lot of uh, things uh, gone through in Sri Lanka. Uh, you, are, uh, the, you are the emeritus professor there in uh, Jaffna University. How is the university functioning now? Because we know that it is one of the oldest uh, university. How is it functioning? Is everything normal there? Yeah, it's, uh, uh, you know, of course, now uh, because of COVID-19, uh, things are all, you know, uh, university uh, is now almost closed. But now uh, the president has said to open it, if possible, to have face-to-face uh, -face, uh, lectures. Otherwise, they have uh, um, lectures uh, through, uh, you know, uh, Zoom and other, you know, using the technology. Yeah. But face-to-face uh, -face lectures uh, yet to start. Otherwise, uh, things are going on well because we have, uh, uh, from, it has started in 1974. Um, in between, the, because of the war, you know, there are disruptions. But now it's uh, going on well. Yeah. We wish everything goes as early as possible. Yeah. All the normalcy comes there. The university is back in, in its original shape. Best wishes <laughs> from all of us. Thank you. Thank you. Nice, Thank you. nice seeing you both. Thank you. Thank you. Hello. Uh, this is Udayan. Uh, Dr. Parabhasaraman is muted. I think I couldn't hear him. Dr. Parasuraman, you are muted. Please unmute. He couldn't, he couldn't unmute it, actually. Please go ahead. We are able to listen to you. I think he has not huh. heard. Okay. okay. 
Okay, thank you so much. Is uh, I'm 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 from Canada, Toronto, Canada. It's early morning here. It's a really pleasure to see Mr. and Mrs. Pravish Danmudas, and um, it was very nice to listen and your exciting and encouraging and very meaningful speech this morning. I have one question. Can you hear me? Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. Uh, can you hear me? So I have a I have always had some problem with this ethical and unethical issues. Which is typically, uh, I know Trikula is very, very meaningfully ethical book, but why doesn't the current legal system not to punish those behave unethically? So it's like a, when I, when I say that when I say that way because unethical deeds is not against the morality but against the it's not against the law, cheating, lying, breaking the promise, and such a such a kind of behavior, and it, it's not. It's, it's the most of the legal legal system we follow in the British system, um, in Canada or maybe UK, USA, uh, they they have um, the system teaches the younger generation it's okay to lie, okay to cheat, okay to breaking the promise. It's acceptable behavior, but not against the law. This unacceptable behavior destroys the human values. It is a big blow to the human social behaviors. And it will do, it will destroy the trust, love, care, and unity in the society. So and the people are increasingly depending on the system, especially Western system. System purpose, purposely designed such a way to avoid people's unity and create distrust among them. That is a way to easy to control and uh, control the people. So that is that is what one of the person really asked about, in, especially in Tamil Nadu government. It's a monolinguistic people, society is okay because typically monolinguistic people, uh, society, if the one person cheat, everybody get to know, talk to each other. But in Western world like that, I don't know, I don't know the person who's living beside my same room, what he's doing. We cannot talk to each other. We cannot criticize each other. Is everybody have very, very isolated living. So in this situation, it's very hard to, uh, makes a society and their people behave ethically. Because if, if I do something unethically in Jaffna or maybe South India, people immediately get to know this person is a bad person, you don't associate with them and everything, then he will not going to behave badly. But in Western world, anybody can do anything. People, other people doesn't get to know because of the confidentiality and other nature and then people. And I don't, I know maybe you know or not, most of the CEO of the world companies are psychopath and sociopath, the research indicate. Psychopath, sociopath is in a way that is unethical behavior. Because if you have ethical person, it's very hard to survive in the future society. It's very, very dangerous. Because when you think about ethical, uh, you cannot survive in most of the companies because most of the CEOs are unethical. That's what the uh, research indicate. So please elaborate on that where the legal system, why the legal system is not much ethical, but people think it's justice. I don't think so, it's a justice. People are, not all the criminals are criminal, not all the innocents are innocent. You know, there are a lot of criminal outside. <laughs> they have not been charged. There are a lot of innocent people in the jail. They have been charged, you know that. But that's why I was trying to bring that issues because we talk about ethics and ethics. If the ethics is part of the law, then easy to make them, people are follow the ethical values. But right now it's not. That's why people are cheating. You know, cheating husband and wife, is no, there's no charge against them. There's no, you can cheat anybody. Breaking the promises, you can do that. So this is what I, my question is. Is it clear okay. or sorry? Thank you. I think you have argued. Uh... Yeah, I think you have argued well for the presentation of Tirukural to the world. <laughs> because if, if you could make arrangements to teach this uh, treatise, to learn or to, to teach, well, they were not, uh, they are not aware of the, these things uh, because uh, they just, uh, as you said, uh, it's all free and everything free. 
you have uh, you have to you have got to follow something you said about the system let us have another system teach uh, the students I have to start from the schools that's why the high court judge uh, ordered at least the tamil nadu government to do that so we have to bring this uh, uh, to the outside world to know about this the translations are only 42 it has been translated into only 42 languages <clears throat> how many lot of languages are there in the world so if we can uh, see that uh, the tirukkural is translated as much as possible then people will come to know about it I, what you I, say is uh, correct we have we are not refuting it i i just want to add uh, it is not only a translation it is not, not only writing in uh, buses which is this tamil to gone i'm not a government has uh, rejuvenated it improved it all these things are there but uh, the law is they will say law will take its own course whereas let me tell you based on my own experience the person who was encroached my land he knows he says he, in the police station he agreed that yes i have done it but the investigators say now we will measure and then decide and then do things that is a proper way law will take its own now ethically a moral investigator would say you have encroached you are agreeing go back to that original position simple but they don't <laughs> but they don't of course the fact that the encroached person is a dmk leader it's another matter the ruling party is a dmk is another matter the normal human values have deteriorated uh, money plays a major role they have deteriorated so no use in writing these tirukkural slogans on the buses you have to be an example set an example uh, uh, i rightly said that law is different values are different even though you tend to think eventually you will get the justice but in between your values now the encroached person says he has spent 2 lakh rupees in building the wall to, uh, to encroach my land it will be a waste of money for him and uh, if i demolish it my prestige will go his prestige will go uh, he used the word in tamil enoda prestige enna sara avurudhu abdiga so that is where that is how it is i mean all the neighbors know that he is done wrong they all tell me but i would expect the neighbors to go and smash him and join me and ask him to move the wall back this is how this is this, that kind of a society we need you know the unfortunate we have people to go and do mob killing for eating beef and other things in india but not for uh, such acts yeah um just uh, wanted to announce uh, mr i think uh, arun gumsar are you back are you uh, i think i am connected now oh okay i am okay. connected now sure, sure. thank you but i will simply i will simply uh, say a few words and then invite you uh, parta sarathi to say the concluding words the word of thanks let me announce thank you one and thank you all the participants who contributed to the discussion um, the next conferences on the 6th of november will have dr bala subramaniam govinda sami former vice chancellor tanjavur tamil university who will talk on internal stability for global peace in tirukkural and then on the 20th of november professor abe kodan from from university of sydney he will talk on is tirukkural a culture of peace and then mr chris punusami retired senior chief executive of the civil service in mauritius will talk on the 4th of december on the universal radiance of the kural a key to good governance that i think is good for us to remember and that you will get the notification in due course thank you parta on to you um thank you sir um vanakkam uh, today is uh, another uh, great uh, uh, event as uh, we had uh, for past uh, 11 events today, uh, today was the uh, today is the 12th event we had and three more events as uh, mr uh, dr prasaram sir said 
uh, we had three more events for this year. Um, you can watch all the uh, past events and the future announcement in uh, international peripheral foundation.org website. And uh, you can also uh, reply to the email that whatever you're getting and uh, you know, uh, watch out the Facebook and other uh, social media uh, connected to this. But yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, so we had a uh, thanks for Manon uh, Maniyamma uh, for uh, joining with us today uh, along with uh, um, uh, Professor. Uh, so to, uh, thanks for all the participants um, from various countries and I know it's...